LEGO usually puts lots of effort into Ninjago minifigures, but sometimes they end up being inaccurate for very hilarious reasons. Bruh. In this video, I will try to fix them. Bruh. Kimono suits actually released without the armor pieces, and Jay even got that goofy jetpack thingy. <laughs> As you can see, they look a lot more complete with the armored look. I'm very glad we received Ping Zayn in Gamers Market set, but we can agree that it's not too accurate. Unfortunately, the symbol looks like Day of the Departed version, but the figure can be severely improved by using the original Zayn face. Why are they looking at you like that? No idea. Ha! <laughs> what? Future Nia is a really cool minifigure, but it clearly looks way too young. That can be fixed by using the 2015 Samurai X face print. There. Now Future J doesn't look like a child predator anymore. What? Adex Cole is the first Ninjago minifigure to feature transparent arms and arm printing. But it can be still improved by adding Cole's ghost face and shoulder armor. By the way, if we get 200 likes on this video, I will make part 2 of this series, so make sure to like if you can't already. Skybound Lloyd has been released in 3 different sets, yet his show accurate version appears in none of these sets, believe that or not. The shoulder armor and mask make him look a lot cleaner. Hero Nia has a really unique design, but she actually features two dark tan arms in the show, representing the fur, which is a detail many people overlook. Golden Lloyd minifigure was surely crazy for its time, but the golden head is really inaccurate. By using the original Lloyd face, you can create a more accurate look. This minifigure isn't even canon, but I was always a fan of Zayn's tournament robe design, and it features this mask piece, which was never a part of the actual tournament suits. By using the white half mask and original Zayn hair, you can create a lot more accurate look to fit within the rest. I was always a fan of DGJ minifigure, but it is actually slightly inaccurate to the show, but don't worry, that can be fixed by using a single black hand. I really dig these stone armor suits, but they aren't too accurate in the minifigure form. In summer of 2014, we got the accurate versions of Zayn and Lloyd. But in the next two years, LEGO went all the way out to complete the set. At first, Kai's armor color is actually wrong. What? Now that this is fixed, Kai, Jay and Cole still feature leg printing. Yeah, you heard that right, you actually have to downgrade them in order to make them more accurate, that's pretty crazy. Overall, this wraps up this video. Did you know that all of these figures were actually inaccurate? This solution was your favorite. Don't forget to leave a like to make part 2 happen and if you enjoyed, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell if you can't already. Have a great day, see you in the next video.